So this is our champagne flute getting ready for the New Year's Eve. And one of the quintessential things that you see is champagne and champagne flutes. So we went and built a champagne flute getting ready for New Year's. I hope that you had a fantastic holiday season and you're getting ready for the New Year's. It's always a fun time of the year. So hopefully you're having a fun time there as well. This was a fun build. Let's go check out how you ah, Let's go check out how I built it. See ya. Bye-bye. Okay, so let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do uh, for getting ready for New Year's Eve is we're going to build a shampoo, shampoo, champagne flute. So let's put five minutes on the clock and let's get started. Reset. Oh, here's an ad. Start. So five minutes on the clock. And uh, if you guys like this view better, let me know. Champagne flute. So, um, I don't know if I use these at the top, maybe. Something like this. Yeah, that's not too bad. If I can do that. So I'm trying a different angle out here. So if you think this is good, let me know. If you don't think it's good, let me know as well. Trying a different angle, trying different uh, setup for the focus. We're gonna try to get make sure that that's very well focused in. There we go. So that's what we're gonna try to do. We're gonna mix it up. Um, based on your advice, we're trying new things. And then if we do something like that, we're trying some new things just to experiment with what we can do to offer up a better experience for you guys. And that's what's important. I want to try something different. Okay, so that's not working. We got to get this up higher. Okay, so how do I get that up higher? Could do one of these here. Nope. Or what I could do is like maybe paint the rim. Something like that. Yeah, that looks better. So we're gonna do that. So we're gonna do this. You know, we're kind of painted rim. So there we go. So uh, it's not tall enough. We need something taller. Okay, so let's try something different. Maybe we'll put these down here. The flute part itself, you know, it's gotta be very tall. Uh, the stem is not normally that tall, so I'm not too worried about the stem part. And we got a cup. We definitely have a cup now. Hmm. Or maybe, maybe we switch up the whole thing. Maybe we go with this design instead. We'll go with the whites. I mean, I should have thought of that first, right? I mean, I should have went that I that direction. And, you know, that just proves to you that the way I do things around here is I do it organically. I don't have things pre-planned. I don't have things pre-laid out. If I have to get a certain color, I typically do that at the beginning of the episode once I already started the clock. So things don't go as planned sometimes. And uh, that just gives you an idea of how we do things around here. Okay. Not, not horrible, but not great yet. So let's take these off and let's see if I can come up with a better way of doing this. Maybe it's something like this. I'm getting the right dimensions first. Okay, then I'm gonna add this to the bottom like that. And then that's gonna add that roundness 
So what normally would not look very round, right? And then we add this here. There we go, that's looking okay. Then we need, I think we're gonna end the flute there, like that. And then we need it to be longer or taller. So maybe we bring in some reds or maybe some dark, dark pink. And we got 30 seconds left. And then maybe some red. I think that's gonna be too tall. Champagne flute, maybe. Five seconds left, and I think we're out of time. I'm looking around thinking, how can I make this better? I could go with more of a white design, but I think that might be it. I think that's going to be where we end here. Gee whiz, I got the dropsies today. That doesn't add anything. Just trying to change it up. I think it's actually, you know, whoop. You can see me, right? Drink, drink, drink. Champagne flute. Not bad. You know, we tried to use the latest colors that we had, which were the whites and the pinks, and it turned out fairly good. And it's got this progression. Maybe it's, you know, maybe it's a, a color champagne flute where the top is only clear and it's got like flame design if you will, uh, going up the stem. I've seen a couple champagne flutes where they're not 100% uh, clear. I was trying to go with clear, but I don't have any clear pieces like this. So I think this works really well. Um, if you agree, leave a comment down below. If you disagree, leave a comment down below. If you think you could do better with the pieces that we have, I'd love to hear what kind of techniques you would use to make this look better to make this look more like a champagne flute. And then make sure to, um, if you go ahead and build something like this, make sure to share it with us. You know, this part of make share daily, share it with us, just hashtag it, make share daily uh, in Instagram or, or Twitter, and we will be able to see it. And that'd be fantastic if we saw some of your creations coming back to us. Okay, let's go check out what we're gonna build tomorrow. So champagne flute, that was really cool. And let's now spin the wheel and find out what we're gonna build tomorrow. So it is a clock. So we need to build a clock for tomorrow's build. That's really cool. It's leading up to the New Year's. So a clock, a change of the clock, of course a clock. So we're going to build a clock for the next build. And I hope you join us at 7 a.m. each and every day. We put out a new video, plus we put bonus videos out at 7 p.m every once in a while so make sure to subscribe hit the link hit the bell leave a comment love to hear your suggestions okay see you tomorrow bye bye